Hello everybody, in uh, this video we're going to be doing a few exercises with finding the lateral area of prisms. Remember the formula for the lateral area of any prism is simply L equals P times H, where P is the perimeter of a base and H is the height. So for number one here, we have a triangular prism, and to find the perimeter of the base, we notice the bases are right triangles, a leg is three, another leg is four, hypotenuse is going to be five to make the Pythagorean triple and the height is 10. Okay, the perimeter is 5 plus 3 plus 4. That gives us 12. We we'll multiply that by the height, 10. So 10, 12 times 10, 120 square meters. And that is just the lateral surface area of the prism. Number two, um, if we want to think of the lateral surface area, let's, let's call this front the base. It's 15 and 10. 15 plus 15 is 30, 10 plus 10 is 20, giving us a perimeter of 50 and a height of 8. And 50 times 8 is 400 square inches. Now, you could call this different bases depending on how you look at it. So depending on how you call the bases, you could also get a lateral surface area of 460 or 540. All right, number three, we got a pentagonal prism. Um, regular pentagon for the bases, six times five gives us 30, and 30 times the height of 18 gives us 540 square inches. Okay, for number four, um, it looks like we have um, a trapezoidal prism. Notice the bases are trapezoids, and the perimeter around each base around each side here is 10, 10, 20, and 9, uh, giving us a perimeter of 49. If we multiply that by the height of 12, 49 times 12 gives us 588 centimeters squared. Okay, for number 5, again we have a um, rectangular prism similar to number 2. Um, looks like we have uh, square bases and for a perimeter of 16, a height of 12. 16 times 12 gives us 192 square inches. Now, again, depending on how you look at this, you could call um, different bases um, different things. Uh, you could call the bases the 12 by 4. And if that's, if that's the case, your lateral surface area would be 128 square inches. Okay, and then number six, we have a regular hexagonal prism, with each side being four. Four times six gives us 24, multiplied by the height of 16, and we have 384 meters squared. And there we are.